Prayer is something that we think should come naturally to us as believers, but it turns out there's a little bit of a learning curve and you almost have to practice. But how do you practice? What different methods are there? And how do you get started? Let's talk all about it today. My name is Eva Kabashik, and I want to help you learn how to study the Bible. Now you might think, well, prayer, study the Bible, they go hand in hand. And ultimately, our goal for both of them is drawing closer to the heart of the Father. So let's talk about prayer. There's a couple of different ways that you can engage in prayer. First of all, what exactly is prayer? Prayer is just a conversation that you are having with God. And it might seem a little bit like talking to yourself at first. That's definitely how I felt about it. But over time, as you develop a more intimate relationship with God, it starts to feel a little more natural and it starts to feel um, like the natural expression, the natural outflowing of your relationship with Him. There's a couple of different ways that I like to pray, and we're going to go through four of those ways today. The first way that I like to pray is prayer journaling. Now, I currently prayer journal on my iPad digitally. I use GoodNotes and an Apple Pencil and a digital notebook, and I pray that way. In the past, I've used actual, like, regular notebooks. My the thing with that is I have a ton of them, a ton of them, and they're all in storage. And so I wanted some way that I could go back through my notes a little bit better and not necessarily have to pull down these like crates of notebooks from the top of the linen closet. So digitally note, uh, mm, note taking, digitally. <laughs> so note taking digitally has been kind of an answer to that for me. And it's been working out really, really well. Ultimately, there's a couple of different ways that you can prayer journal. You could write out word for word the words that you were praying. You can take bullet points on a list, like just like, I want to pray for this and this and this, and just bullet point out the list. Um, sometimes I use a grid section. You can see that in one of my shorts, I actually did, um, a short about how I set up my prayer journal each month. If you would like a longer video on how I set up my prayer journal, just comment below and let me know. And I can make a more detailed video for you about how I journal each month and set up that monthly journal. The first method is prayer journaling. The second method is prayer walking. And this, you just, as you're walking, you pray. And you can walk and talk. You can um, go to a specific location that is more um, like meaningful towards what you're praying about. There's all different kinds of ways to incorporate prayer walking. I personally struggle a little bit with prayer walking because my mind wanders and it seems like the walk itself, if it's not in a meaningful location, it's harder for me to keep my mind focused on what I'm praying about. People that really like movement and they really like the moving their body while engaging their mind, prayer walking is a great method of engaging with God and talking to him. The next one is just incorporating prayer throughout your day. You can set up little reminders as you go throughout your day to prompt you to pray. I keep a sticky note on my mirror with specific requests of things that are heavy on my heart right now. And so while I'm brushing my teeth, while I'm getting ready for the day, I am praying through those things. Um, a great place to put this might be on your microwave or the cabinet that you open when you're making coffee in the morning. Different reminders throughout the day will help you to continually draw your mind back to prayer. And then the last way that I want to talk about today is praying through scripture. My last video was all about praying through scripture. And over the next 40 days of Lent, we are going to be praying through scripture together as a community using my borrowed prayers 
book. This is just a book of 40 days that guides you through these different ways of praying scripture. I've got the link for the book in the description, but I also wanted to let you know, I've got a free class coming up tomorrow on how to pray. If you are like, this is all just so new to me, I really want even more basics on how to pray. This class is going to be a 30 minute workshop and you are welcome to attend for free. Now, if you were signing up and it's way later, you can still use the same sign up form down below and I will send you the replay of the class so that you can still get all of the information even if it's a little bit later. And like I said, it's completely free. So you can sign up down below. And if you would like to learn more about praying through scripture, you can watch my last video right here.